everyone. So I know that in my last um, Little Black Bag unboxing video, I told you all that I was thinking about doing a second. And guess what? I did! Yay! So here's my next Little Black Bag for the month of August. I've already gone ahead here and just cut the tape, but I haven't peeked inside. I am super excited because I did some amazing trading this time. And I actually ended up with two pretty big items. So let me just get into this here and open this up for you guys and show you what's inside. So I'm just going to open this up here. Here's my little packaging slip. Says everything that's in here. Alright. And I'm going to... This is what the outside looks like. Ta-da! Lots and lots of tissue paper. Wow. Added it with tissue on the bottom too. Okay, let me get this big box out of the way. It's all empty now. So here it is. Ta da! All wrapped up. Let me unwrap it and start pulling out my items. Okay. Oh, my husband was so nice. I had actually kind of, even though I was thinking about it, I had decided against opening another. But then they brought back this bag from like a few months ago that I absolutely loved. And I was like, Reef, please. And he was like, yeah, sure, go ahead. So, yay. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and start out with my smallest item. I did get four items this month. And here is the first item. Oh, these are cute. I think I'll actually wear these a lot. Okay, sorry. Here you go. Ta-da. I got these Spring Street earrings. They were um, retailed at $14. Look how pretty those are. I really like it. It's kind of like a little... These are actually the pastel. And they really are kind of pastel. These are super cute. And then they just have these like pin back. This is the back of it. So you can see. And then I think these are going to be really, really cute. Yay! Um... Anywho, so this was kind of my smallest little item. Um, and then next I got this necklace by, I think it was that, or Spring Street. No, Spring Street is the earrings. And like I said, those did retail at $14. My next item is this pendant necklace by All The Rage. And this retailed at $20. Here's the stone. And what I love about necklaces like these is that these things are always, you know, so unique. No one else has the exact same one. I will say, let's see how long this is. Um, it's a little shorter than I thought it was going to be. But it's not a bad length. And I think actually... Yeah, I could probably actually even take the pendant off and put it on another chain if I wanted to. Because I will say, I think the chain on this is pretty cheap looking. Especially with the pendant on it. I think I will probably detach the pendant and put it on a longer chain. Because I like really long necklaces. And then probably snap this together again and do like you know, a double bracelet or something. So, I think that would give it a little, make it look a little more expensive. But that retailed at $20. Again, it's from All The Rage. And then, okay. So, I actually got two bags this time. So, here's my next item. And it is, oh my god, so much bigger than I thought it was going to be. And I love it. Ah, look at it. This is just like, so cute. And you know what? I don't have any clutches like this whatsoever. Oh my god. Okay, look. And so it has this little nice, like, snap opening. And I mean, it's not very wide. It's, you know, obviously it's just a clutch for, like, a nice dinner party or something. But I love this um, side, like, these side colors. This is actually, like, a fox leather. And on the website... They gave a horrible picture of this. Because even though I thought it was cute on their website, like, 
this looks like ribbon or satin, you know, and this is actually kind of like a nice fox leather, if you can see that. And then the inside is the blue satin ribbon, which makes it look really nice. It has this one little, you know, pocket here, and then, um, yeah, just the, the inside, but I think this is super cute. This is from um, MMS Design Studio, and this retailed at $48. I want to say. Yeah, $48. Now, and how I got this was I actually traded my original bag like um, three times before I finally like said, okay, I'm done trading this. You know, not enough people have it for me to trade it anymore and I'm sticking with it. So, but the cool thing is too, it also comes with this like detachable chain. So like you see these hooks on the side there, it would just it's actually since they made this so like the thing so small it's a little difficult to open but it would just go on like so there's one on each side and they're just little um, snap closures and then it could have a chain as well if I wanted it to and this is really nice the chains really sturdy I think it's got a nice little detail of its own it's kind of got these funny almost paper clip effect if you can see that so I'm in love. Yay. <laughs> okay. Dun, 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 dun. Here's the big item. So here they wrapped it up all nice and cozy so it doesn't get, um, you know, dirty or damaged on the way. And, gosh, this thing is really long. Okay. Oh. Awesome. And it comes in a another dust bag. This is actually a Melly Bianco bag and I'm so excited because I've been seeing all the YouTube videos, you know, of like her bags and I love the little like polka dot thing inside and I just, I think it's super cute. So I wanted one of her bags pretty bad. Okay, I'll turn it around so you can see the front first. Yay! This is the, um, Gosh, I think it's the Melly Bianco Lock and Key Satchel. That's what it is. So, and it's called that because, let me get some of this wrapping off for you. Because it's got this little, like, lock and the tiny little key and, oh man, this is so cute. I got this because I wanted to be able to carry my laptop in. And I will say on the site, it looks... Like a tiny, not a lot, but like a tiny bit bigger. And I thought my laptop would fit in here. But seeing it in person, my laptop's not going to fit. I have a pretty big laptop. So, anyway, so you can carry it like this. Or it has these detachable, um, gosh, see, detachable, uh, shoulder strap. And I really like this little chain detailing and then how it goes to the leather. And it's also adjustable, so you can make it, you know, longer or shorter but isn't this just so cute and then the inside oh it's actually a zip closure on top so let me unzip that wow they put a lot of let me get the tissue paper out Woo. oh and they put cardboard in the bottom to keep it shaped that's cool oh my god the inside is like adorable look I love it it's like so cute, and there's like these little pockets here, and then on this side it says, the, it's got the little Melly Bianco, you know, stitch um, label right there, and then there's also a zippered pocket directly above it, let me show you that, there's the zippered pocket right there, it's a really good size, you know what, maybe, I definitely, my laptop definitely won't fit in, like, like, I guess width-wise, but I think it'll fit in length-wise, possibly. But anywho, I think it's just really cute for when I want to be a little dressier, or I might even use it as, like, a carry-on. But this retailed for $98. Oh, I didn't know it did this. It actually has these little snaps here on the back, like, so, you know, you can maintain, like, kind of an extra fun detailing, but you can also, like, take it off and snap it further to, like, make your bags smaller. 
you know, like those expansion ones. That's cool. And like it actually runs through the side here so that or you could even take it off, I guess. But kind of like a little belt around bag. Super cute. I'm totally thrilled. I'm glad I opened a bag for this. So, and actually, what I started out with was this bag. A, I had an $18 jewelry item, but for the life of me, I can't remember what it was. And since I opened this bag, like, late at night, I forgot to write it down like I normally would. So I could tell you guys, like, this is what I traded for this. And then, you know, so, um... And then I also had a Redken bonus item, and, oh goodness, now I can't remember. I had another jewelry item worth $20 that I traded, but whatever. So I, I just, you know, I did a lot of smart trading this time. Like I said, I traded my original bag away like three times, so, um, and I got like two bags each time I had traded it. So that, and then I turned around and like I would keep one and then I would trade the other bag for little things or, you know, so. Anywho, but just to recap, here's my Melly Bianco um, Lock and Key Satchel worth $98. My MMS Design Studio Clutch um, for $48. My Spring Street Pastel Earrings retailed at $14. And my All the Rage Necklace stone pendant necklace um, retailed at $20. So that's what I got. Hope you enjoy. And um, if any of you are interested in a little black bag, I can definitely send you a personal link. Just please comment below and don't forget to subscribe. So thanks. Bye.